Kevin, this is Sean with Legendary Marine. Just wanted to do a quick walkthrough video on that Sea Hunt 27 game fish you and I were talking about. Let me know what you think. Starting at our transom, we got twin 200 horsepower Yamahas on the back. We also have joystick steering with this. Nice live well in the back. Big fish box right here on the transom. Cutting board, fold out seat. Pull it out of the way when you're fishing. Side entry door over on your port side. And we do have a ladder that hooks up to that as well. So if you're diving or at the sandbar, it's a easy way to get in and out. Nice tow rail, under gunnel rod storage, combing pads, extra storage over here. Tools. You got nice combing pads, jail, audio speakers throughout. Nice upgrade to have. Either side of your leaning post, you have nice storage as well there. Plano box is set up. Here, ball opener. Can't leave home without it, I guess, right? Got little spots here for all your extra leaders, tools, knives, and a second live well sitting on the leaning post as well. Extra rod holders. Uh, this one does have a very nice hard top, jail audio speakers, extra rod holders, everything's powder coated. Spreader lights, you have the kingfish rod holders. I believe that is an upgrade on these. You can see he did put the canvas enclosure around the console. Walking forward to our home. Twin 12 inch garments. There's your joystick control. Yamaha throttles, push button start, which is kind of cool. Autopilot, this does have radar on top as well. Very comfortable leaning post setup as well. Walking forward, you can see we have a nice inset handrail, powder coated to match everything else. Pop up stainless steel cleats throughout, full porcelain toilet, holding tank, and overboard flush. Here's your power. Battery switches, access to all your gear and a little extra storage. All the electronics, as well as this piece of vinyl right here opens up for access. So they did keep maintenance in mind, which is always nice. Can't beat this boat for comfort, for the family days and stuff like that. Bring all the cushions out. You have the bow filler cushion, table up there, forward seating. An additional seat in front of the console here. Up top you can see the radar we were talking about. You have your outriggers of course. Anchor light. Real clean T-top and enclosure. I like how they did the glass with what they call the deep piping. Everything's nice and flush and clean. It's good look. Here you have a windlass, controls up here as well as at the helm. Plenty of room. I'll get you a couple profile shots and call it a day. Back at the business end, you can see our 200 horsepower Yamaha four strokes, stainless steel props. Eighteen pitch will probably be well into the 50s on this boat. VHF radio, I didn't mention that earlier. There's another angle of that side entry door. I got the wide angle lens, so it looks probably a little weird, but good looking boat. Big old bow flare. Chines to help you dig in and knock the water down as well. There's a reason why these guys are the number one selling center consoles last 14 years in a row. Again, this is Sean, Legendary Marine. Let me know your thoughts. Thank you.